Cutting the passenger seat back is utilized to fold the seat back down to aid in patient removal in the event the release mechanism is inaccessible or damaged. In this video, we'll expose the release mechanism and review cutting options. You normally will be able to make your cuts without the removal of the outer cover of the seat. However, we have removed it here for instructional purposes. As the mechanism area is exposed, you can see the structures that we are dealing with. We see the pivot pin, the heavy gauge steel at the base of the mechanism, and bolts. You should try to avoid the reinforced areas and cut the support that comes up into the seat back. This is the weakest point and cutting it will allow the seat back to fold down. We must maintain control of the patient during this tactic. thing to deal with with the uh, reclining seats is first off try to find the mechanism find the mechanism side release it if it releases and the seat back goes back great but a lot of times during the wreck those get jammed so if you have to cut it try to go to the mechanism side first and the reason we do that is nine out of ten times the other hinge is just a dummy hinge cut the mechanism side the seat back will fold back but a couple things you gotta you gotta look for on the uh, on the seat mechanism the rolled steel right in there is a real strong piece uh, that we don't really want to cut through because what will happen is once your cutters get on that as you close your cutter tips will start to separate and once they start to separate if you keep going you're going to shear possibly shear a tip off so instead of cutting through that all we need to do is expose it or know where it is go above it to where the hinge is <clears throat> and cut through that area right there that's the least amount of metal we cut that, the mechanism doesn't matter anymore because we're cutting the seat away from the mechanism. Cut that side, the seat back should recline. If it doesn't recline, then that's telling us that the other uh, hinge is an is a, uh, actual hinge that holds the seat up as well, and we have to cut it. Always know where your rescue tool is in relation to the patient, and remember, know more than one way to accomplish your extrication goals. Thank you. 